Surprisingly, this is the only Boca Juniors special card EA have released in this Conmebol Libertadores Team of the Group stage. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to a brand new FIFA 21 video. This is Leo here bringing you another special player review and today we're going to be looking at Lisandro Lopez. Yes guys, the center back from Boca Juniors last year. He did get one of those player SBCs and honestly guys, I know a lot of people did it for fodder, etc. But he was a fantastic card with a shadow chemistry style. And as you see, I applied an anchor because I don't have a shadow in the club. I'm too lazy to go buy it. But I think with an anchor chemistry out, he should be decent enough. He is 6'2", medium high, right footed, two star skin, was two star weak foot. I did buy him for 30 5k guys that is insane if you're building an argentina inside this is a must get on your side and as you see on the screen i'm gonna show you the squad right now this is the squad i am using today actually i'm gonna do this so carlos alberto can be on full chemistry and yeah guys this is incredible man so if you have an argentina inside look at this guys i know jashin is not argentinian but you can put um what's his name martinez as well and you are good to go because this card is fantastic. And let's look at the in-game stats. And yeah, guys, like I said, man, this is the first time looking at the stats. And I could already tell this guy is going to be in a complete tank on that defensive side of the pitch. He does have 83 pace, 80 acceleration, 85 sprint speed. And I'm looking at the acceleration of 80. I think I'm going to go by a shadow chemistry style. So the acceleration can be 90 and the sprint speed can be 95. On to the passing of 80. Elite level passing for a center back. 79 vision, 94 short passing, 84 long passing. Good stuff from Licha Lopez. I think that's what they call him. Unless that's the other Lopez. I don't really care. I'm going to call him whatever. Dribbling at 78, 82 agility and fantastic. 70 balance, good enough. 92 reaction. 92 composure he is clutch now onto the defending stats at 91 91 interceptions 90 defensive awareness 91 standing tackle and 90 sliding tackle close out the 91 defending on this fantastic argentinian wall and lastly the physicality of 90 95 jumping 92 strength 92 aggression Fantastic, I guess. Like I said, guys, I'm gonna go buy a shadow. I think that's the best way to go with this Licha Lopez card. And lastly, the player traits he does have power header. Oh, he does have 95 heading accuracy. That is crazy. 95 jumping as well. So he is 62. So we might get a header or two in with this Lisandro Lopez. Who knows? But I'm really interested to see if this guy can hang with the elite type players in Division 2. I did drop a little bit, but I mean, still, Division 2, Division 1 is not much of a difference. And we're going to be testing out Lisandro Lopez's ability to play with these type of players. So let's get on to that and see if this card is worth it. Vamos Lopez, Licha Lopez against Memphis by team of the season. Vamos, great standing tackle right there. All in animation. First highlight of the ball game. Vamos Licha Lopez. We have a tough battle today. Eusebio Pelé, team of the season, the pie. Side to side movement is really good on Lopez. I did leave the anchor chemistry style because I do have about 200 rares in the club. Look at that standing tackle. Oh my goodness. I went to buy a shadow, guys, and it just got lost in the unassigned pile. So right now he's with an anchor. Two highlights so far. On the ball, he feels alright. Good pass to Vidal. Licha Lopez. Se la pasa para Changalai. Se viene. Ooh, almost an assist for Licha Lopez. We did get a header. I mean, we did get a corner right there, but my opponent moved the goalkeeper really far out, and I knew I wasn't gonna get the header. But great pass right there from Lopez. Right, come on, Lopez. Look at the recovery speed. That is that agility, guys. Pele had him beat. But thanks to the little high pace right there and agility on Lopez, he was able to catch up to that. Fantastic. My opponent is very tricky. He's doing a lot of skill moves. Vamos otra vez. Otra vez. Let's go, Pele. Look at that 10 out of 10 right there. Oh, my goodness. I'm super impressed by this Licha Lopez card. Nice. That's the reactions right there. That's why I like a high reaction player. He's able to do that. And uh, yeah, guys, good stuff from Lopez. Nice. That's George Best, guys. Hey, defensive awareness right there. 
World Game Number One completed for Licha Lisandro Lopez and. Let me tell you, I got the player I played was a complete rat. He scored two goals and he just passing it in the back, guys. He was passing it in the back with division rivals. 38% possession for me, more shots than this player. Honestly, I don't know how he is. He's just, I don't know how he does it, guys. He was playing five at the back for the most. And look at that, man. No CDMs as well. But I mean, what can you do? Whatever. It doesn't really matter. He did get managed the match, though. 8.3 rating, zero goals, zero assists. But pass it completed 8 out of 8, dribbles completed 7 out of 7, and tackles won a game high 4 out of 5. You can be here to see the defense, guys. And you saw it until he scored the goals. And then after that, there was no second half highlight. And there's a big reason for that. He was just passing it in the back. Like I said, guys, it doesn't really matter anymore. Game is over. Let's get on to game number 2 and see if we don't have to play a rat. Let's go. Great tackle right there from Lopez, man. Good stuff. So far, he's been the MVP of my team. Just saving me in the back. He's outplaying that team of the season, Romero from Atlanta. Vamos, Lopez. Great raid right there. I read that through ball, and he got it with no problem. Oh my goodness, guys. Wow, what a sliding tackle. I'm impressed by Lopez, guys. He's, I'm probably going to keep him for 35k. I don't, I don't really care about losing those type of coins. But for the price, he's playing better than Cuti Romero, guys. Look at that. Another standing tackle on Kylian Mbappe. And Cuti Romero is the Atlanta center back. Nice, Lopez. Great interception right there. I played the pass right there. And he got it once again, man. This is an elite level center back. I know a lot of people... You're never going to see this guy on the team, but... If you do play him, you know what I'm going to say, guys. He's on par with my... Um, what is it? Moments Gomez? That's how good this card is. No bias. Buena bueno. Chancala. Craig. Things have turned up after the first two games, which I did struggle in for some reason. We do manage to break through... 3-0. And we're on our way. There we go. Lopez. Vamos. Elite level, guys. That's team of the season son, I believe. Let's go. Sliding tackle. Look at that sliding tackle. Calm down, bro. You're not Maldini, but... <laughs> Yay. Yeah, Stop the play, at least. Man, even though I was not enjoying the gameplay today, we definitely did get some incredible highlights with Lisandro Lopez, Licha Lopez, guys. I'm going to be calling him that. I don't know. Like I said in the intro, if you call the other striker, Lisandro Lopez, the OG Olympic Lyon legend, that or this card. But he did fantastic and he was a legend in his own right. Really good center back, and I enjoyed him more than Romero team of the season. I don't know what was going on today, but he was saving him a lot. And onto the biggest pros, guys, and the reason why he was saving Cuti Romero a lot was that sprint speed of 85. It is definitely felt. I wish I could have played a shadow on him, but I did have about 300 to 400 rares that I need to sell in the unassigned pile. So I went to buy a shadow. And he, it was gone. It was completely lost in the unassigned. So I'll probably get that eventually once I sell the pl uh, sell the players that I do have in the unassigned pile. But definitely go with the shadow with this card. It'll feel even faster than he did with an anchor. Another big pro of his is that 92 reactions. You saw all the reacting he did on the defensive side of the pitch. The composure of 92 is a big pro. The 91 defending guys. The 91 interceptions. 90 defensive awareness. Good stuff there. So I lumped it all together. Just put the 91 defending as a big pro. And then next pro is going to be that 92 strength he is a strong physical center back so if that is the type of players that you like to play in that position definitely this uh, Lisandro Lopez can definitely help his own and Leo Tess, I would pair him up with you got the green link of Angileri who is a monster guys you also have Romero of uh, team of the season Atlanta you have Otamendi as well you have a lot of linkable options but that's why on the con you see a link link as well because he does not have 
that many links aside from one or two cards. Boca Juniors did not get more cards as expected. They're one of the bigger clubs in Argentina, so I don't know why they only got one. I believe River Plate also just got one as well. So that is a little bit mysterious. Maybe it has to do with some rights issues or whatever. But I would have loved to see more Boca and more River cards. And on to the meta rating. Meta rating this card is going to be an 8.5 out of 10. He's a very meta center back. And you saw what he did in Division 2. And final rating, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. He was very, very solid. And he definitely did remind me of that moments Gomez. I know Gomez has 90 pace. But from the defensive side of the pitch, I believe Lopez felt a little bit more dominant. Maybe it has to do a little bit with the physical, the reactions. I don't know what it was. But this card was really good. And it definitely impressed me today. But anyways, I will conclude today's review. Hopefully it helped you out in the side whether you want to get this card or not and you enjoyed this review before i let you guys want to say thank you so much for your support on instagram and youtube lately i have been killing it with the support and i love seeing that guys please take a second out of your day like this video subscribe to the channel and expect a bowl review very soon this is leo i bid you goodbye and good night